Hello, one and all. So, my name is Melissa. Um, thank you for everyone who subscribed. This is video number two on this channel. I'm pretty dissociated today. Um, Maggie was out earlier, so I don't know how this is gonna go, but I'm going to... This video I wanted to make about the quirks that I dismissed that were pretty strong indicators that um, we are multiple. So let's get into that. Quirk number one. Well, this one's a little bit sad, um, but it, it has a good ending. One of them was the girl in the mirror. I saw my reflection or the girl in the mirror as someone else. And there was a lot of loathing self-hate. But the sad thing is, the really sad thing is, now looking back, knowing that um, I, I was kind of sensing an alter that I was talking to, is that she was a little girl. Um, and I, I gave her a really awful name, but uh, she's actually not awful at all. She's not hateful or awful, and she wasn't deserving of hate at all, but I would talk to her. Um, and and I, I would... I would say awful things to her, but I and I did in fact see her as someone different. Um, separated her from myself, and I was like, "Where am I in the mirror?" Um, I felt very dissociated from my reflection, <laughs> and yeah. So that was this is, it's, it was an ongoing thing for her. I don't even know how long. I mean, it was it's been. I have notes about her scribbled in my journal since. God, what year was that? I think the earliest I found notes of her was... 2007? Um, yeah, so that's been going on a while. I have even made a video on my, um, my, my, my channel, I Drank the Seawater, about uh, six or seven years ago, which I'd taken down and re-uploaded. So you can see something about that if you're subscribed to that channel as well. Um, another quirk uh, was, I don't know, it's, it's weird because like so, sometimes well, when I speak aloud, I say I, like I, Melissa, say this, think this, I feel, I say, I saw. But when I think to myself or ourselves or when I muttering aloud, like I mutter a lot, I kind of narrate and I don't know why I do that. <laughs> But I, I verbally speak out or think to myself, okay, we need to do this. Let's do this. Let's go. Um, and if ever there's some kind of narrative going on, um, including something that we're doing, it, it has to be properly specified. We have one mouth because there's only one mouth here, even though we are many. Or we have one body, but why would I have to say we have one body and we have mouth, one mouth? That's not grammatically correct either way. Like, I mean, yeah, there's one mouth here, there's one body, but we're not many either, I didn't think. At least I... But I just, I had to specify it in bo on both sides of the thing was that we are we and we have one mouth. And if I didn't say it specifically like that, it, it just felt... Well, I mean, it, it, I couldn't accept it. It, it was like... Something inside me was saying, correct that. Um, so I had to correct it if I said it wrong. If I said, we have mouths, <laughs> I was like, nope, mouth. Um, so that was one thing that was a quirk that I, well, I mean, I thought it was a quirk. Um, so that was, the, that's thing number two. Another thing, hearing, hearing people talking in my head. Um, and, I, and, and I'm not saying outside my head, I'm saying in my head. Like, uh, it doesn't sound like it's coming from the next room, in other words. It sounds like it's coming from inside my mind. So that's been since, I, I, I don't even know, but I dismissed it. Like, once in a while, it was like this kind of a sudden, like, there you go, that's what, the, that it said, whatever they would say. Sometimes uh, my name to get my attention. Sometimes um, commentary. Uh, and I every time I was, well, maybe not every time, but I mean, very, very often it would startle me a lot. And I would think, what if I'm not alone in my head? And then I was kind of kicking myself with embarrassment and thinking, wow, that's really sad thinking because clearly you're alone in here and 
that's impossible. It's impossible. It just can't be. So every time it would happen and I would think, oh my God, I'm not alone in my head. Who, who's that? Who's there? Um, I shrugged it off because it just couldn't be. It couldn't. Um, so I dismissed it every single time. Um, next quirk. Moments where I was acting unlike myself and I couldn't figure out where that was coming from. Like, uh, say that I was acting like I had, or it seemed like I was acting like I had mania or like I was having a psychotic break, like I took way too much freaking ginseng or some kind of weirdness. I was like, what is going on? Something is clearly wrong. Something is very different. Something is, something is not on the, the normal level here. And I was being diagnosed with all kinds of things or, or guessed to be certain different things. Uh, mania being one of them, but you know, I was very aware that something was different and um, I, I, I couldn't figure out what that was and I didn't have like 12,000 disorders. I, I, I had apparently one main one, but I couldn't figure that out. You know, I was, I was, I knew something was wrong. It had to be wrong. One thing was I was thinking, feeling two separate things and they could be opposing, like completely um, it wouldn't have made sense. Like, say I like stoves or I hate stoves when well, I'm sitting next to a stove in the fridge. So, <laughs> can't tell because map. Um, say like I, I, I think two very opposite things. Um, but both are true. I feel strongly about two opposite, two, well, about one thing in an opposite way, but both are true. Um, so I could recognize what I felt and I could also recognize feeling something else and know that they were facts like when exclamation mark was out and he was he was talking about what um basically I could tell that what he was saying was factual he was saying some pretty scary things um that, 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 that could have ended our lives um and and I was like that's really scary. Um, and at the same time, I was like, that's completely fact. That's they, I, that uh, they mean what they say. Um, of course, at the time I thought that I was the one saying that without understanding how it was possible. Um, but you know, I was able to write what I thought, like in, in my words, fluently writing what I thought, but I couldn't say it aloud because everything that came out of my mouth or our mouth, was what exclamation mark was saying. And I couldn't get my own word in, I, barely. Um, so I was able to write completely fluently. So if it had been a psychotic break or mania, I would have been just as disorganized in my writing. But for some reason, at least that time that there was a switch, I was able to type it, which was thankfully, because we needed help. Looking at my list. Got that one down. I think I pretty much covered it. Um, you know, I wouldn't have guessed it myself. I mean, at least things that I, I was kind of quick to break my, my list. I might have should have gotten a little bit more um, in depth. But you know, that of, of all the, my history of, of for the last like year of this of things going like way worse. I mean, obviously I've had DID forever, but in terms of the last year, it's been bubbling up a lot, it's been going on. So I'm not gonna go over everything in the last year and everything in my whole life that's happened that would indicate DID for in one video, that would be really long. Uh, but this, these are like some, some pretty obvious points that I missed. Um, my psychiatrist figured it out and it was like, you're dissociating. And I'm like, what? I'm, uh, d it, Disso dissociating I suppose that I uh dissociate it's what I'm like what's his problem you know so and he's been he had been telling me for months he said it was a very very serious he puts the paper down that was referring to the mania that was um suggested it was mania and I'm like it's mania <sighs> and he's like no <laughs> you're dissociating and then the bobbles of, uh, and yeah. So I'll be making a few videos today. <sighs> so I feel very dissociated. I'm gonna make more videos. 
That's exciting. So I have someone that asks a few questions I'm going to answer. Cool beans. Talk to you guys later.